Howdy, this is Edward from Valarm. In this video, you'll learn how to remotely monitor environments like greenhouses and hydroponic gardens. Do you need to know the CO2, carbon dioxide, temperature, humidity, light, and other sensor factors in remote locations? This tutorial shows you step-by-step -step how to see all of your remote sensor information with a web browser on any device like a phone or your tablet. You can also receive custom alerts and warnings. For example, if CO2 goes too high or low, the lights go out, the humidity in your greenhouse drops, or the temperature goes too low. You can get a greenhouse hydroponics monitoring kit on shop.valarm.net that has all the pieces you'll need, like you see here. A sensor hub for uploading sensor data to the cloud via Wi-Fi or 3G GSM cell network, a medio sensor that monitors temperature, humidity, and pressure, a light sensor to know what the current Lux Lumens light levels are, a CO2 sensor for measuring current parts per million or PPM of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere. Once you've got everything connected, plug your Valarm greenhouse monitoring unit into your computer's USB port to do one-time initial configuration settings for linking your sensor hubs to your Valarm Tools cloud account. If you haven't already done this before, then watch our other video tutorial on connecting your sensor hubs to tools.valarm.net. With your sensor hub linked and sensors mapped to field columns, you'll see your latest greenhouse and hydroponics garden information at tools.valarm.net on maps and graphs and you can set up email alerts for your custom thresholds. Now you can know how your garden's growing from anywhere in the world with an internet connection. See our other video tutorial on email alerts to learn how you can set threshold ranges and get alerted whenever your conditions aren't exactly what you want. Perhaps a light goes out and your growing is no longer optimized. Now you'll know if there's a problem no matter where you are. If you need to monitor any additional factors like water or other assets like tanks and vehicles, then have a look at our other videos and our webpage at www.valarm.net. You'll find more info on our blog and how you can add additional sensors to your Valarm systems. Also, if you or your teams and organizations need web-based dashboards, you can use our APIs like JSON to make your own or we can make a custom dashboard web page for you with your logo, widgets, graphics, and interactive maps. Please don't hesitate to contact us if you have any questions at info at Valarm.net or you can give us a call at 424-442-0963 in the United States. Thanks for watching.